Hello YouTubers, in this video we are going to use this keypad with the STM32 blue pill via interrupt method. I have included debounce also. I have made another video, it's available here. In that video I got number 0 to 9 and got a servo motor and the keypad. When you press number 2, it goes number 2 and like that. Let's try press 5 and 0, 9, 1, 8, 5, 6, like that. In this video, we do without the server motor. We only connect the keypad and we get the value to the system. When we zoom in here, from A15 to B9, we connect the keypad. The wiring is very simple. It's like this. I have opened the cube ID. If anybody doesn't know how to install cube ID, I have made a separate video. It's available here. We can continue. Click system core. Click sys. For the debug, serial wire. Now, we make we need to make these four pins. PA15, 3, 4 and 5, PB5. GPIO output. I do one by one. Need to make this two pin and this two pin, four pins as a GPIO EXTI. I do one by one. Like this, this one. We need to click NVIC and we need to tick this one. I need to make it bigger and tick it here. That's all the setting. We can click save. While the code is generated, I'll show you something in the description below. I have given website address. I have created this one. When we go below, the diagram is here. Picture is here. And the cube ID setting is here. We, we already done. Code is here. In user code begin PV, we need to put these four lines. Copy four lines. And we go back to cube ID. We wait for a while. Go below. Here. We paste it here. We go there again. User code begin 2. And we need to put these four lines. Copy it. We go below. Little bit up here, we paste it. Now, user code begin for that's where the interrupt is there. We copy this from here until until all the bracket, this including these two brackets. We copy it, we go there. User code begin for is after the while loop. Here, we paste it here. Now, that's the callback, that's begin for. Whenever the button is pressed, it comes here and uh, it executes. And uh, when we go below, for example, if pin C is pressed, it checks here and it gets, and key pressed is 67. That is the X C S key value of C, like the D, B, A, and all the numbers are here. And we get these numbers to the key pressed that this value we can use it in the main loop to control something. Now we can click save. Use this button to build and see. Errors all good. Now, instead of uploading the code, we use the, this button, debug button, to uh, debug and see the, when we press the button, to see the value. Click debugger. Probe, we use open OCD. It will work with the original board, also with the clone board. Click show generate option. Go below. Reset mode is software system reset. Click apply. Click OK.
live expression the, with the reading glass on it and here we need to paste this number this value key pressed we copy and we, we paste it here and see whenever we press the button what are the value we are getting zero now it's initialized now we run this one and i'm going to press the button start with d nine five three b zero like this now this is how we get the value we use this value uh, in the main loop to do something i have made another video to control the server using keypad it will be available here you can see if you want thank you very much for watching if you have any question write down in the comment section below i'll try to answer as much as i can thank you bye